We're up at my buddy's. Currently in the process of building his new house. So we're putting in a lot of fill. He's currently working on the garage right now. Turn this thing back on. So it's got me running the skid steer while he's scooping up all the fill. They're making a tremendous project. Every, every day after work, they come in, work a full day's work, and then come here all the way up, work until nightfall, making this happen. Uh, I think they got until Friday to get this basement, pretty much, not basement, but this uh, garage all set. I'll tell you for one thing, I have not ran a piece of equipment in about, I don't know, let's say about 10 years. And I'm currently in a new, brand new New Holland skid steer. This thing is a blast to run, I can tell you that for a fact. So it's not just me and my buddy running the equipment today. His fiance is also out here doing, utilizing the small excavator. And you'll see that when we start breaking down into the garage, she's the one moving the dirt inside the garage and then tamping it down. came to the site started building you got two Hollands you got an excavator over there and then you got the skid steer right here now you've been in construction for a while haven't you oh uh, shit or shoot <laughs> you can bleep that out right <laughs> it's fine <laughs> um I've been in construction for oh boy 16 years 16 years so it started Six, out really 16 young. 17 years yeah so primarily you've been around John Deere's right yeah John Deere um case no caterpillars new holland i know is a case but okay. pretty new for us anyway a new holland so how much interaction have you had with skids years before before you're owning this one zero. zero i mean i used the street sweeper uh bobcat before yeah, so when I first got here, this is my first time ever using a skid steer. Other than that, I'm just using the excavators, but that's all foot pedals mostly. Yeah. This is all hand control. The only thing that's on the ground is pretty much just your throttle, right? Yep. Yeah. So, super easy. I've been away for like 10 years, haven't used any type of equipment mm -hmm. in the meantime. And I, I mean, I'm not a no pro at this, but it's pretty easy to learn the new controls. And it's, it's so easy that it's just common sense yeah. when it comes to this beautiful tractor what is it a 2019 or it's a 2021 2021 so brand new <laughs> straight out of the box you got it with pretty much zero hours on yeah it. yeah so yep. yeah uh it's not much of, of a review video it's just showing the capabilities of the tractors obviously we got bigger equipment in the background but yeah. i wish you the best of luck with this yeah uh, Super fun. I mean, anytime you get behind a tractor, you're gonna have fun. So. Yeah, I mean, this this one. I mean, it, you give you give it 10 minutes, and yeah, it was 10, 15 minutes, and you pretty much got the hang of it. 10 minutes, and I started <laughs> I started playing with the throttle after a little while, especially long doing the long stretches. But yeah. that backup camera, oh my god. Yeah, it's cool. And I, I was saying earlier that like how interactive it is. You know, some backup cameras have that little bit of delay, but this thing is like on point. So you... yeah, I mean, it's a little hard to get used to. You still have the the mirror, and you're so used. To, there, there's not a lot of uh, view in this, obviously. Yeah. There's, there's a lot of blind spots, so the camera's handy. Um, I'm not used to it. I still don't look at it. I've still backed into things here. <laughs> so.
tell you for one thing, I am having a blast. Even though I'm not saying anything. Yeah. Someday. I'm supposed to buy a tractor this year, but bought the boat instead. Alright, so pretty much at this point, as we were continuing on throughout the day, I was obviously bringing over all the dirt with that, the skid steer, and then they've been scooping it in and putting it in here. But between like, I think about an hour to maybe two hours since I've been here, and we put a foot of dirt in here. Still got quite a work, uh, quite a bit of work. Uh, we're gonna add a little bit more dirt to the corner, and then it's gonna wet it all down, and then tamping. So. It's already almost 9 o'clock, he'll probably be here until 10 o'clock camping and he's been doing this non-stop since December, so definitely pounding away. Sucks that I'm not up in the north country all the time or else I definitely be sissing more often. Alright. Well, good luck man. Yeah, thanks for coming man. You're it's welcome. Fun. <laughs> That's a wrap. Yeah.